Hello there, my name is Mr. Smart Donkey. Welcome back to my last play of Renowned Explorers International Society. Last time we left off, we were in the Transylvanian... Transylvania? Transylvanian region, of course, just the region. Uh, and it didn't go too well. <laughs> Definitely say that. Um, we, we had to redo the boss fight about four or five times before we finally managed to get it. But we did do it. Um, we're down to free resolve, though, which is not great. Um, so we're gonna have to definitely be fairly careful in this next expedition, which is the Shangri-La expedition. Um, but on the other hand, we need to be somewhat, uh, we need to take risks as well, because we're at 1,346 for now, and we still need to get about 654 more before we beat Riva Lowe, so it's gonna be rough. But anyway, before we do all that, we've got some research to spend. Um, gain two supply, supply cast capacity, that's pretty good. That's what screwed us last time, but this is also pretty good. I think, actually, I can get both, just about. So I think we'll go for that. Uh, I don't really care about that. I, although I should have a look at, perhaps, if there's something that will do something with more, um, more, uh, survivability, what do you call it, resolve? Probably not, though. Doesn't really look like it. Now let's just go for these things. Ooh, gain one extra token from each job where you spend inside on the world map. Oh crap! Oh, ah, I should have done that before. Damn it. Um, what's the finishing for this, by the way? Starting uh, completing plus fifty percent stat gains from perks. Oh wow, that is pretty good as well. I should have gotten that earlier. Definitely didn't think through too much about what I did. Um, we got a whole bunch of, well, not a whole bunch, we got a, a, a bit of money as well, so we should probably spend that. We definitely need to get an item for him, just something. Uh, there was an item that was alright for him, wasn't it? Can't quite remember. I mean, it's two attack powers, it's not really that great, is it? Um, maybe one of the other shops. The loot, plus five speech power. Find cooking pot that gives the bear extra perks as long as there are five supply or more. Gain a survival perk cooking, tactician perk weapon expert, and uh, fleet perk stamina. That's pretty good. Plus 10 speech defense, but when confident he loses minus 25 percent speech defense. It's not really... It's like that's only when it's tyrannizing. I could probably upgrade one of the... We have a lot of uh, status, so I should definitely upgrade some of the towns. Before we do that, let's check out this one as well. Um, when the mood is friendly. Plus 10 spear, just plain plus 10 spear, that's pretty good, I do like that. But I should upgrade, maybe I can get something better here. Uh, oh, Plus 5 attack, speech and attack power, and plus minus 1 speech attack and attack power. What? Hammer. Hostile. Oh my god. Such a massive downside. Oh, this is max level already. Well, let's just max out the other ones as well. I don't get this, though. Like, is it basically just plus four? I don't know what that means. What does it mean? Double rainbow all the way. Um, let's get this one. This one's got a lot of items. Nullify damage taken from a rage speeches. Uh, chemistry set. Terrified ability to plus 50% power against impressed targets. Uh, he doesn't have even any terrified anyway, so that's pointless. Alright, so this is max level as well. We've still got a decent bit, so let's max out the last city or town or um, thing as well. Saw. 20 grit. Weak damage taken from saddened speeches. Gain the quick thinker perk alert. Quick thinker reflexes. Lose 50 grit when saddened. Ah, oh, such a. The massive downside you get as well. It's just not worth it. I want something that just gives me, like, something positive, and that's it. Oh my god, these books. Never afford that. Actually, I should look around further as well on the other shops, perhaps. Since I maxed them all out now. Yeah, these are all 1,350. That's, I guess, the, the highest level is just 1,350. Plus 10 speech and plus 5 attack. Uh, 320. I guess I could just about get two of those. Increase the power of Excite and try to... Yeah, that's pretty good, though. 20% buff on those. These are... This is probably better, but only barely. Um, so again, I'd still rather just get an item for him. Plus 10 speech, 20 speech even. 
I don't know. Start having counter confident. Weak damage taken from confident speeches. Resist damage from terrified speeches. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I'm so confused right now. None of these seem like particularly good. I guess we'll. That one, like, if you're saddened, you just get wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. Maybe I'll just go for that, that thing that gives plus 10. Like a plain plus 10. Uh, six attack when the mood is escalated. Plain plus 10 armor, or spirits. Let's do that. There you go. Right. His gloves are a master. These are like low level items. Memento. Uh, that's a defensive item. Right, he doesn't sell any defensive items. Nor does he. This one does then. Right, so I should probably buy one memento. 15 speech defense and 5 armor. I can buy two of those. Good armor. It's pretty good as well. I can buy two of something at least. Get a slight upgrade. We don't want boots. So good armor and one good memento. Extra speech depends on armor for one of them. I'll go for one... Actually, if I sell... No, nah, that's not going to be enough. Well, whatever. You got that, and you sell this, and you got that. I'm 142. Actually, yeah, we are nearly being able to buy another good memento. Not quite. Actually, if we sell that, we can buy another good memento. Yeah, I mean, that's probably better. Lose some power, but... Alright, well, that's all we can buy. We got a whole bunch of status we can still get, though. Uh, into Entourage. Let's see. We want to get... Whatever. Naturalist, Diplomat, or Athlete. I don't know. I guess I can upgrade this as well. These ones don't seem to do much, though, to be fair. I guess we can get level 3 now. Gain one extra collective resolve on account of Devious, one campaign resolve on account of Devious, one study when you resolve on account of Devious. Yeah, we'll go for study. And I guess I'll just get one of these as well. Athletes, Diplomat, or Naturalist. Let's see. Uh, diplomat 1, Naturalist. We have none of those, so that's completely pointless. Yeah, we don't have anyone at level 2 or higher on any of these things, so that's pointless. Right, well, let's get a few helpers more. Um, we tend to get a lot of these ones, so I guess I'll just get a few more of them. And... Let's get some more... Eh, gold's pointless at this point as well, isn't it? Let's get another upgrade and get another one of those. Alright, fuck it. That's, this is good enough, I guess. Got nothing else really to spend. Alright, boys. Let's go to Shangri-La, shall we? Difficulty 5. I'm not looking forward to this. This is an incredibly perilous expedition. River Lo has obtained the Sham Kala Key of Privilege to open the gate to Shangri-La. If you're fast, you can still collect more Sham Bala Keys and get there before him. You will find the toughest of challenges of all sorts and kinds, but there's an amazing amount of renown to be gained here. <sighs> well, I do believe that, but I guess we want to try and avoid as many encounters as we can. This is it. You can finally prove that you're a better explorer than Rivilo. You can do so in none other than the most magical place, Shangri-La, the Himalayan Utopia. It is said that one's dreams come true bit by bit when you're in Shangri-La. At the center of Shangri-La is the Palace of the Sintamani. This orb is a treasure of mystic proportions on par of the Ark of the Covenant and, of, and El Dorado. If you retrieve it, you will go down in history as one of the greatest explorers of all time. Can you see victory among the illustrious row of Vasca de Gama, Zhang He, and Ibn Battuta? <laughs> of course I can! But first, you need to beat Rivalo. It is said that the orb can only be obtained with the four Shambhala keys. This will surely be an advantage at the palace. As you know, Rivalo already has one and will be looking for the keys as well, so it's better to find them before he does. However, you might be able to snatch the orb away from Rivalo even without the keys. No time to lose. Time for adventure. I see, okay, so that's where we want to head off to. What is this, though? That's where we want to be. I mean, we, it looks like we might want to go here and then there. These two are... Oh, man. Everyone of these is going to be encounters, isn't it? I think I should go for this, because this is purple, which means it's somewhat important. Oh, I'm down to free, free resolve, though. We got two tools, at least, but... 
You arrive at a place where one of the Shambhala keys is said to be hidden. Tiger Mountain. Okay, here's one of the... Okay, so we wanted to be here anyway. Old masters who perfected their martial arts are said to meet at the top of the mountain. With the Shambhala key, you gain, can gain the blessing of an elder master, which will surely help you. A divine light is emanating from the top, a sign that the key is still there. Look for a way up. This is going to be tough. The mountain is an ar arduous climb. You could have someone lead the climb, or better, it's... Or maybe it's better to let someone find a hidden route. Now well, let's find out what their percentages are. Those aren't very good. Those are even worse. Okay. Uh, or we can give up. Wow, okay. I can get up to 49... 46% chance. And we lose one resolve if we were to fail it. Can I use two tools? I don't know. Oh my god. I also wasted one of these if I go here. The thing is though, how are these other challenges going to be? Ah, uh, 46. I don't trust that, but... Let's do it. One resolve loss. Here we come. Uh, and we lost it. Of course we did. Just the fucking bout. Oh no, the crew gets pretty far under Victor's guidance, but at that moment, Maria slips. Victor tries to save Maria, but fails. The crew tumbles down into a river far below. After being washed ashore further away, the crew looks at the Tiger Mountain. The shining light on top of with that Shambhala key is gone. So we lose one resolve and we don't even get the key. Well, this is already like... Can we just restart it or something? When was this? Because this... Like, we need to... We need to succeed. That was saved 15 minutes ago, so I would have to redo all that shit. Fuck that. Well... That key is gone. You see a light for the demon running with a bag. Okay, fuck off. You, Victor gains minus five speech. Well, fuck Victor. Next. <laughs> this is not gonna happen. You arrive at the temple of Yab Yum, the symbol of love. Your deepest desires can come to life here. Victor's correct. One of the Shambhala keys must be somewhere in this temple. You have to be careful for the trap of seduction is set to be laid out here. You enter the temple and, goodness gracious, it's crawling with beautiful and charming people. They welcome the crew of undeniable warmth. Welcome, beautiful, intelligent, sweet people. Please join us and allow us to adore you. You must get across the room to continue, but this offer is tempting. Maria, please. Oh, what is this? This is going to be impossible for crew members who are either gullible or want to be famous. Amelia can't resist all those nice com compliments and all those beautiful people in adoration. Could Amelia finally have made it into heaven? Gullible and fame-seeking crew members won't be able to get to the other side. Crew moves forward while politely thanking all the people with the crew determination is falling. This isn't going well. There is a gong on the other side of the room. Striking it is set to stop this beguiling madness. All hope rests on one person to win the battle of charms or iron will. Alright, Maria, right? Oh, no, never mind. She's also getting schmoozed. Wow, this is never going to happen. Will? Oh my god. This is... <laughs> what? I'm never going to succeed in any of these. Uh, I suppose I could use both keys. Oh, I can only use one. If I lose this, I lose another resolve. Ah, fuck it. We have, we have to. Like, there's no... Okay, we got this one, right? Yes! Alright, we got one. Victor's charm is superior and the beautiful people ended up following Victor. In the end, Victor hits the gong. The beautiful people disappear like illusions, which makes Maria kind of sad. The crew cannot continue. You arrive at a cloudy hall, the Shambhala key of the heart at its center, but your attention is quickly drawn by two people in front of it. Amir, Rivalo's scout, and someone that looks like a, a lot like Cassandra, Rivalo's scientist. Amir seems to be talking to Cassandra, his face blushing. Take a peek. If I could say it to this fragment of my desire, I can say it to Cassandra. Here it goes. Cassandra, I love you. Oh, I screamed again, sigh. Maybe I should continue, just continue to impress her with my insults. Oh, the poor fool is only so mean because he has low self-esteem and wants to impress Cassandra. Now it all makes sense. But then Amir noticed you. What? Why are you here, my friend? Oh right, the Shambhala key. You did not just see that, and the key is mine, my friend. It seems you have to engage to see who gets the key. Alright, let's engage and get wrecked, because this is a level 5 encounter. Oh my god, this is never going to work, is it? Alright, study or campaign. I guess we'll try and go devious. Oh man. Oh, look at the health of these fuckers. 70 spirit on each one of them. So there's Cassandra, it's a fake Cassandra, and Amir, and he's got an elite henchman with him. Look at all these fuckers! Oh my god, I do nothing against them. Oh, even our best abilities, nothing. 
Well, AoE is kind of pointless, isn't it? It gives them more speech. Although I imagine they're... Melee. Alright, so... This makes you stronger if you're aggressive, but weaker if you're friendly. Alright, let's be friendly. Oh my god, this is never going to work. Plus 30 speech defense. Okay. Uh, you're going to go here, maybe, or there. Um, if I put you here... Yeah, alright, we should be able to move here, and maybe we can even slap one in... No, we can't get the kill, not even close. Well, move you over here. You be friendly to this guy right here, please. Friendly abilities plus 25% power. Oh, that's actually pretty good. So we should probably try and go for Devious here. Oh, for f the love of God. Alright, you kill him then. And this is just one encounter here. We're How are we supposed to make this? Like, this is crazy. Oh, he barred off. Okay, friendly abilities plus 25% power, so... Just gotta hope that we can... Use those. Oh my god, he, he's gonna get here in like two turns. Yeah, and they're all, they're just gonna kill all of us. Oh, he fumbled, okay. I mean, at least we've got a heal, but she's terrified. I like how they've all got baseball bats, but they don't actually use them. Okay, that guy didn't get a turn, apparently. How are you supposed to make this, though? This seems, like, crazy. I'm not even sure if that would kill someone. Um... I don't want to use the heal yet. Okay, let's kill this guy. Friendly videos have 25 extra power right now as well, and we're still not even anywhere near killing any of them. Okay. No, plus 40 speech defense. That's pretty good. This gives them extra speech, so we don't want to use that. Yeah, friendly is actually better. Uh, let's start focusing on him, I guess. I mean, it's not even looking terrible. If we can manage to kill these guys and then get to the boss, but the bosses, they have like a million health, so I'm not even sure, like, if that's ever going to work. Look at that Amir guy, how much health he's got. That must be like 250 or something, and he's already there. Oh my god, he actually got an attack off as well. She might just die right now. At least she only moves one spot a turn. Yeah, she's still alive, but that means we're gonna have to use the heal now. She actually is probably going to die now anyway. Because he's gonna get an attack off on her. Yep. Fumble. Nope. We have one resolve left. Oh my god, this is never going to work. Not in a million years. I don't think there's any point even restarting this. Like, we're just not gonna make it. There's no way. I could heal her, but I'd have to run all the way over there. And she can do it, but then... She can't use her heal anymore, so we have to do this. I know the heal's kind of pointless, but I still have to do it. If he hadn't reached, we would have been fairly decent, but he fucking ran across the entire map in two turns. Look at his movement! Oh my word. Uh, she can't even kill anyone because she's not in range anymore. She could hurt him, but not kill him. Just whatever. We're, we're dead. This is never going to work. And I don't think I'll even try rest Well, I'll, I'll restart it, but it's not- it, We're not gonna be able to make this, and this is just one of the fights, and I bet you this isn't the hardest one either. <laughs> Look at that damage he does. She dies, and that's it. Oh my- Why did she just get her moving all of a sudden? She just moved one space, and now she moved like six. And that's it. It's- It's- This is- Never going to work. Not in a million years. I mean, I'll try it again, but it, I'll, I'll just try it once more and that's it, because there's, there's just no way. We're not going to be able to do this.
I don't know how the hell you're supposed to be able to do this, to be fair. Okay, slightly better starting position. This is only... Actually, no, there's one over there as well. Where is his movement? Why can't I move over here? Like, this is three spaces away. What happened to his movement? He can get there, but he can't get here. I don't understand. Like, these guys... I, no, I just... Eh, there's no point in complaining. This is, this is never gonna happen. The thing is, that gives them extra speed, so I don't even want to do that. Plus, it doesn't even do any damage, because everything is just weak right now. That, in combination, still doesn't kill him. Alright, let's just try and kill these guys first, I guess. Um... Yeah, fuck it. Let's go aggressive. Oh, that's a good stop right there. Minus 30 speech defense. Love it. That means I have to go with Devious or I'm fucked. I need they block Devious, of course. That's just great. Well, hopefully it's still enough damage we can do. I think it is. Unless we fumble, but even then, we I guess we still get it. Because apparently, like, it still gives you free when you do two attacks. I don't know why or how that works, but... Friendly ability is plus 25%. Okay, well, we need a free people to kill one guy. Like, that just... Oh yeah, and he just fucking runs a marathon in one turn. And she apparently as well now. Wow. Quite surprised they weren't able to reach, to be honest. Okay. Uh, friendly plus 25. Is that enough to kill in one hit? No, of course it's not. Not even close. Can you guys... I guess you want speech defense, so... Can you guys kill this one in one hit? It looks like one, well, two hits. It looks like you can. Let's just do that. But this is this is just never gonna work. Like we're we're nowhere near equipped enough for this. I don't know how you're supposed to be able to do this normally, because this is not like possible and. I mean, I'm sure I'm not great at this game. There's so many different abilities and stuff, I really can't be bothered, like, constantly combining them, ever, like, perfectly every time. But there is just, like, no way... Where the fuck is she going? And he managed to reach... Oh my word, that is... Oh, he fumbles as well. Maybe the only... I think the only thing we can do is try and nuke him down, but I imagine he's got, like, super good defenses or whatever. He's nearly dead, though, so I would want to kill him. Aha, uh -huh, you're in love with her. You can't do it. Okay, I think I try and run away from them and just nuke this guy down or attempt to. She can't even run away. She's stuck there. I guess someone is going to have to kill this guy. Um... So I want to be friendly against them, yeah, right. Which means that... Why is this stuff down? Oh right, he had that thing. What about, are you, what about you though? Why have you got... Oh, your emotion, okay. Right, anyway, um... So I want to use you to kill this guy. So that she can get away. And you use that on- oh my god, it's nowhere near anywhere going to ever work. Well, do it anyway. And you go over here. 
Oh my god. I didn't actually check how much health he's got. Let me have a look. 250, exactly. Watch out for his destroy confidence, which deals extra damage to Saturn targets. Also, don't stay friendly for too long, or you might get stabbed in the back. Okay. Don't know how that works, but sure. Yeah, we have Saturn targets, so he's gonna do extra damage to us. And the thing is, even if I manage to kill him, I'm pretty sure... Oh my gosh, just 34 damage. Even if we manage to kill him, there's still that Cassandra lady that we have to kill as well. I just don't understand, like, do these bonuses carry over? Like, are you supposed to play this game, like, several times before you can actually finish it because there's nowhere there's no way in in hell i'm sure there's people that have finished this in in on the first try but fuck that like no way i freaking have to use this ability on her to make her not sad anymore but then someone else doesn't make her sad and it just doesn't it doesn't matter what i do i'm just gonna nuke but it doesn't matter we're all gonna die He can't even get- she can't even get a melee anymore, so that's not even worth- or I can't even do it anymore. Fucking pew that way! Oh, I can't even shoot it wherever I want. She's still sudden, okay. Oh, minus 30 armor. I guess now they're gonna use the baseball bats, I assume. Yep, oh my god. Holy shit, 59. That would kill any of my characters in one hit. Well, that, that's it. I'm, there's no way I would be able to do this. There's just no way. So I think I'm, I'm gonna have to end it there. Expedition failed. Unbelievable. Just bam, that's it. I mean, I can keep retrying, but there's no way. Like that last, that, that other battle that I had to redo five or six times, I actually had a chance of doing it and I, I managed to do it in the end, but this one, there's no way. There's just no way. I'm not gonna be able to do this. So yeah, uh, Crooked Capitalist Victor Signac was attacked and traumatized in Himalayan peaks by the infatuated Amir Akhtar. Start a new game. I'm not actually going to start a new game right now, but just wanted to get out of there. So, I am sort of interested. I mean, let's have a quick look. I, I don't know if it's going to tell me or not. Yeah, I guess it all carries over. Like, I can use them now as, like, ability, or as, as like, um, what do you call them? my crew, or my captains, and then I assume... Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, I assume that she also keeps... Well, I don't know, do you, I guess you don't keep your, your items or anything. But I wonder what you do keep. Like, I'm not, I'm not sure what you keep from, like, the previous... I guess you keep the research stuff that you've already done. And maybe some other stuff as well, like maybe the shops or something. I don't know, either way, I, I might do another expedition. I kind of want to finish the game, like get it actually done. I, I know it's said in the beginning, it's supposed to be played over several playthroughs. So, I guess maybe you're not supposed to be able to do it on one try, but I still would have liked. I got, Although, I guess if that's the main goal, then it makes sense to you can't do it in one try. But then it's also kind of annoying, because you know, like... You, you know, not being able to finish your game on the first try just because it's impossible, because it's too hard, is kind of annoying as well. Anyway, um, we can have a quick look at the treasures that we got during our first run. We got the badge upgrade, which is just like the standard thing. We got a bunch of other stuff. We got that massive 100 year fruit pineapple thing. A bone, St. Andrew's bones. Man, there's a lot of treasure in this, isn't there? And the cross of Lothair. Yeah, I probably will do another one. I mean, I, I kind of want to finish this. I hope that it stays, like, fun enough for you guys to watch as well. I don't want to, like, do this if it's not going to get any views, obviously. But anyway, I'll leave it there. And next time... Well, I, I assume you'll see me back again, because I, I probably will want to do another run. And I, I kind of want to finish it, but we'll see. Um, but I'll probably definitely do one more run. I'll probably definitely do one more run. Anyway, until then, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Have a good day, and goodbye.